everybody, welcome back to another standing ovation break. I got me some of 2122 Upper Deck Series 1 Hockey Hobby Box. Looking for some cold call fields, maybe some Pintos, maybe some Kalen Addison's. A Addison? Kalen Addison? I don't know, there's uh, a little bit of action in this product now as the season has started up again. Series 1 from 2223, just around the corner. Actually, when I'm filming this, it's still a couple of weeks away. Uh, I may be in Toronto for that weekend to pick some up. We'll see what happens. The Expo's going down that weekend, and uh, yeah, I, I got some uh, stuff to do in town, so I may make it all the way back east just for that show, and uh, well, not just for the show, but in the meantime, I mentioned to rip some Upper Deck, which you know, we're waiting, and artifacts I'm kind of done on, so I got last beer series one, um, again, I'm, I'm out of Caulfields, actually, I've been out of Caulfields since, like, last year, I think I pulled two of them, and I sold them, like, right off the bat, they went for oh, about a buck fifty, and then that card dropped way down in value, and now it's climbed way back up again, so I'm hoping to get some more of those cards, and, uh, who knows what else, like I say, the Shane Pinto is kind of a hot card right now, and it's hobby, so you may hit some high gloss, some, some, some exclusive, some, something neat, who knows, Let's see if I can't get myself involved in a box of ripping of Series 1. Which, uh, I don't know if I've done a whole box of Series 1 hobby on the channel yet. I know I've ripped plenty of these. I think I've like three or four of them when it came out. Um, but yeah. I don't know I've done some Series 2 looking for those Mo Cider cards. Mo Cider. I need my Mo Cider's. Still haven't hit one. I got Lucas Raymond. I got Byfield. But I didn't get my Cider yet. I don't know what's up with that. Let's we'll see how that guy plays this year. Just took a quick look at the stats already. The, the stack, uh, Mark, there's a Matty Berniers on the Kraken. is already off to a great lead of rookie points. But then closely behind him is um, is Pinto on Ottawa. So there you go. Caulfield played well in his uh, early start. Two goals against my Leafs in the very first game. And I haven't been following him since because it just makes me sick. I'm still disgusted with the way the Maple Leafs have been playing this year. And every year for that matter. But you get a little bit of excitement going on from time to time. But I swear, as a Maple Leafs fan, I feel like Charlie Brown. The Leafs are the football and the Stanley Cup is is, is Lucy. Right? So every year you come up to kick the ball and then she pulls it out from under you and you're flat on the back. And then next year you come back. Every year you try it because you know you're going to kick that ball. But no, she pulls it every freaking time, that Lucy. That Lucy, Lucy Van Pelt, I tell ya, I tell ya. Anyway, let's fix these all up and have some fun ripping open Series 1. And uh, Charlie Brown our way through this box. Hopefully we get a Caulfield. I've actually done alright lately in my rips. I've hit a few good cards, but uh, yeah, I'm going to bring home the banger. How about a high gloss? Cool Caulfield, right here, right now, on camera. Wouldn't that be cool? Wouldn't that be sweet? Let's get some light on this. Let's put light on the situation, and let's look at the product. Have you had a chance to look at Upper Deck Series 1 yet? No, no, no. Let's have a look. All right, Josh Norris. Yeah, speaking of Senators, off to a great start. That team is young and feisty and who knows? Who knows how it's all going to end this year? It's one of them years that, yeah, who knows? Konechny, Ty Smith, our first pack with the young guns in our first pack open. It's Keaton Middleton. Not sure the deal on Keaton Middleton with the Avs. 4 and 98 from Alberta. And there you go. I think I need them, but maybe not. I'm still building a set from last year. I'm down to about 19 young guns, maybe 18 of them. I'm not working too hard at it. Like I say, I, I seem to sell off the good ones when I get them right off the bat. And then I'll trade for them later if I need them still. That's generally what I tried to do. Then when I get the set done, I generally set a whole set eventually too. So it's like I don't collect. I do. I collect certain players. A few of them here and there, but it changes from time to time. I got, you know... My Daryl Settlers and my Boris Salmings, but I don't know. It's hard to collect Maple Leafs because, yeah, they're Maple Leafs. Marceau, Cackle, and Letty, Elias, and a canvas, a Barzal. That'll go good with my black canvas Barzal that I just pulled there in a random pack break. Oh, not so very long ago. Where did I just put my random pack break cards for hockey? Just took them aside. Let's see. I'm pretty sure... I'm in the void now. I'm in the void. Oh, goodness. Okay, where are we going? Maybe I'm just imagining everything now at this point. But it doesn't matter. I just wanted to look. I'm pretty sure I just had that black. Barzal. 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 Anyway, let's carry on. Who cares? You guys don't care. Do you care? No, I think maybe one of you might care a little bit because you kind of like Barzal, but no, maybe not. Barzal. Barzal. All right, Matt. Carry on to the next pack. Third pack in. We're going to hit. Looks like an insert 
that, uh, who knows, Forsberg, Gandel, Sorky, a rookie retrospect, retrospect with Alex Nedelkovic. Nedelkovic. I did it! Everybody, I did it! I said Nikhil, I did I, Now I can only say it one time. Alex Nedelkovic. See? I watched a few Ziri videos and listened to him. It just rolls off that kid's tongue. I don't know. I can barely say Nedelkovic twice in a row. Yeah. It's good for me. Surprise, surprise. Old dog, new tricks. Oh, make, make a mess. Look at that. Okay, let's go. There, carry up. Donsky, White, Fowler, and Meyer. Nedelkovic. I said Nedelkovic. Just like that is a word I said all the time. Alex Nedelkovic. Is he still with Carolina? I don't think he is, is he? They sent him on, they traded him away, and I don't know where he is now. I don't know where I am right now. Tyler Myers and Tage Thompson and Richard Ponick. Here comes a dazzling blue dazzler of Zgrass. Right on. That's a good one to get. Rookie, cut nice. Unlike the last Zgrass I pulled, it was a orange one cut like a drunken sailor had his hands on the scissors. Philip Kurashev, Marco Heiskanen, Marcus Felino, and Jeff Skinner. Oh, uh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Let's push these up and around and make them look appropriate. Make them look pretty. All nice and neat for the camera there. Hope you guys had a great weekend. I'm sitting here on a Monday morning cracking cards. It's great for me because I like to start my week cracking cards. I used to have to get up and go to work, work my ass off all week, but my life has changed drastically and I'm going with it. I don't know. Maybe I should be worried. Eventually, I'm going to run out of air as well as food, money. No, I'm all right, folks. This is a good way to start your week. I highly recommend it. Grab a box upper deck and rip her open. Trey Krug, Trey Krug, Patrice Bergeron, Tyler Toffoli, and a canvas of Sorokin. Peekaboo. I see you. Uh, okay, Barzal and Sorokin. We're going for all the Islanders, apparently. Adam Fox, Tarasenko, Dadinoff, and Miller. Yeah, it's uh, been a long road to hoe. I worked my butt for a good 30 years solid. I'm an old fart now, and my body breaking down. I just said, you know what? Let's take some time off and deal with life the appropriate way. Living it instead of working it. And you know what? That approach has made things different for me, I tell you. It's fun not being so uptight all the time. And boho oh, right. Except for when I get a box of cards that produces, like, ding corners and stuff. I don't know. My uh, recent upper deck rips have been a little bit frustrating mind you that it's the way we all seem to have it. Kaprizov debut dates. It was on January 14th in 2021 the Wild vs. the Kings that Kaprizov debuted, debutted. Koskinen, Hannafin, Archibald. Archibald! Look at this. I'm not pulling any young guns. That's it. I'm just saving them all for the end. Except for this pack. I think, this is, I think we're due. We're honeydew. Or honeydew boba. Whoops. That's not supposed to be talked about in public forums. Oh, we're due, we're due, we're due. What are we going to get? Morgan Riley. A checklist. A checklist. Devin Taves. Chick DeBrusque. Horvat in en français. Beau Horvat. Say that in French. Beau Horvat. It's both, it translates pretty pretty much the same. Hoglander. Aho. Nurse. Nurse! Give me my scalpel. I don't know why. I just want to cut stuff. Oh, do, 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 do. Let's rip a uh, back right here. I don't know. I'm getting close to halfway, aren't I? Maybe. Where are those young guns? Hello, young guns. Milan Lucic, Tristan Yari, Kevin Carvender, Ankaran. Uh, sorry, Kevin Lankin. Him. Trevor Moore. It is hard to talk sometimes when your tongue is upside down. Milan Lucic, that rough guy. He's a rough man. Very rough. Gruff. Modern day sea bass is what he is. And Morrissey, Mackenzie Vigar, and Ryan Pulak. He just making some money up there in Calgary now. They just took him to the team like he was an old friend reuniting. Yeah, the Canadian teams this year, Canada, uh, well, except for Vancouver and Toronto, because they always suck. That's just the way given. But the other teams look kind of exciting. Uh-huh. Uh, Nico Heischer. Rasmus Dahlin. Victor Arvidsson. Kyle Connor UD Portraits. 
I got a nettle pull vote. You see, I, I can't do it twice. Nedelkovich. Nedelkovich. I'm going to have to go to speech therapy again. Jacob Slavin. Andre, Andre, Adrian Kemp. Or is it Kempe? Nicholas Sch Homerson. Schalmerson? Schalmerson. And what else we got coming out of here? Oh, well, let's see. This pack's going to rip the little thread off the side and make me go for the double rip. Come on, getting all detailed here. Michael Bunting. Still haven't got his young guns yet. There you go. It's kind of weird that I've got a lot of lease, but I haven't got him. Maybe they're going to trade him. No, they wouldn't trade him. Blackwood, Bunting, Edmund, Zuccarello. Oh, what are these? This is the young guns. Let's get some more of these. Sure, why not? Art to Rootslinen. McAvoy, Gensel, and Hayes. McAvoy, Hensel, Gensel, and Hayes. Uh, I say Finland and Alberta, age is 97 on roots, born in 97, born in 98. So these are not spring chicken young guy rookies, like that Cole Caulfield guy. Calling Cole Caulfield, calling Cole Caulfield. Please make your appearance in the next few minutes on video right here with Standing O. Oh, yeah. Barlamov, Shen, Shabbat, and our canvas, Kyle Connor. To go with our portraits, Kyle Connor. Neat. TJ Brody. Justin Hole. Jeff Carter. And Jeff Petrie. Yeah, the, get the, get the uh, young guns. Let's put these young guns out front and center, maybe. So you can see them and enjoy them for what they are. Dollar store rookie cards. Oh, I didn't say that, did I? Well, you never know. These guys may be the next bust-out players of the year. Okay. So far, it looks like my Kaprizov... Debut dates and my Zegris Dazzlers are my best cards out of a box of hobby. I'm not I'm not saying too much till I finish, but so far I'm, I'm, I'm waiting for something that says wow Zach Breeze, Tyler Sagan, Eric Robinson, Alex Debrinkit, and a young guns of Uka Pekalukinen. I'm not sure if I had him yet. I know I had the Hooser, the Hoser, the Hauser. So I got a Uka Pekka Lukanen, Youngins, and a Robertson, and a Zucker, and a Schmaltz. So, we're off and running with our Young Guns. There's Tree of Six, expected uh, to have six. You never know, some boxes will give you that seventh and eighth, depending on your clear cuts, and your canvases, and your Frenches, and your who knows. Artemi Panarin, Josh Bailey, JT Comfer, Chris Tierney, I got a Honor Roll Superstar of the Cross. He is the Cross. You are the Cross Man. Terry, Drew, and Bolkvist. And we're past the halfway point now, folks. It's all downhill from here. Every, everybody's still wearing their seatbelt because it's going to get exciting. I'm going to pull the handbrake and just do a 180 on this in a second. Uh huh. Laurier, LeBanc. Kubelik, Debrinket, Electromagnetified, Theodore, Edmondson, and Kuznetsov. And we going into this pack here with... There, finally the fan turned off. Sorry, it's a little noisy in the background there. I didn't realize that. I thought that buzzing was just in my ears. Apparently. Sorry, it's better sounding now. Thomas Grease. Brent Burns, Alex Kerfoot, Mark Shifley, Robin Leonard, Vegas, Golden Knights, Portraits. Tavares, Chuckles, and Allen. Now I messed up my piles just because, just because, because. This whole system is messed up now. The whole system. Why, these packs are really being... Making you have to use your whole fingertips to get them right open. There, there's Zach Borensky. There's Sean Walker. That's not, but it is. It's Rasmus Ristolainen. And there's my fourth canvas in a box. Why? Why? Nathan McKinnon. I wanted a Young Guns canvas. Even though Nate Mack is a good one. PLD, Beryl Dubois, Jack Hughes, and Jack Eichel. With a Matthias Eckholm. Okay. 
Well, looking for that hobby exclusive pack, the one that gives you that card that says, that's why I bought a hobby box. So far, I haven't found it. Radulov, McCann, Keller, Backstrom, Cam York, Young Guns. I think that's my 99th Cam York Young Guns. And Chikrin, Rat, and Jesper Bratz off to a great start this season too. Just thought I'd point that out, but nobody, everybody probably knows that. And we got Juicy Saros. And we got Ben, the Bennington, the Binster, Bin Bins. Anthony Torelli, Young Guns, Kyle Burroughs. Okay. Anton Kudobin, Kali Ma Kale Makar, Kyle Makar, Vitek Vanacek, Adam Anurik, and the next pack. So, looking like we're looking like we need a banger. Sorry, I just pulled that off camera again. I, I do that, not like I'm trying to be a cheater cheater. I just want to make sure I load the right pack up right at the right time. So, all 10 cards come out with Young Guns. My video goes viral, and I become famous. Yeah. Famous on Sports Guard Radio. Jack Campbell. That's not where you want to be famous. Jack Vorkchuk. Jakob Vorkchuk. Brandon Gallagher. Kaprizov. Insert. So I got two good honor, superstar honor rolls. Not that those are really worth tons of cash, but they're fun to collect. Kreider, Lee, Fleury, and Yossi. Calling Cole Caulfield, please make your appearance in the next five packs. Cole Caulfield, you're wanted at reception. My reception, right here, right now. Please report. Do not delay. Ethan Bear, who just was traded. I can't remember to where. I think I heard. I don't remember now. Maybe it was Calgary? No, no, they wouldn't have gone to Calgary. Don't know, but he's not on the Oilers anymore. That's the whole story on Ethan Bear. Johnny Goudreau who's no longer a Calgary Flame. Philip Zedina. I don't know if he's still a wing. I think he is. Thatcher Demko, letting all those goals in in Vancouver. Thank you, Thatcher. Matthew Tuchuk. It's not like it's his fault. The team. Yeah, they're, they're the Canucks. One Young Guns to go. This is a very underwhelming box. Very, very underwhelming. But it could all change right now when Cole Caulfield makes his presence known. Matthew Tuchuk, Connor McDavid, Dennis Gurianov, Gabriel Landeskog, and a fifth canvas in a box? Wow, that's just incredible. Shattenkirk. 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 Oh, Rasmus Anderson, Jakob Rana, and Jared Spurgeon. Yeah, like, I usually get, what, three in a box? Maybe it was different in Series 1. I can't remember. Well, that's a lot of canvas. They're dumping the canvas on me. What's it say? Canvas. Read it. It says 1 and 8, doesn't it? 1 and 6. Okay. Well, I'm I'm going overboard on that. There's Cousins on the back and Schultzy on the front. Justin Schultz, that is. Gibby Gibson, Jakob Silverberg, and Josh Dunn. Young Guns. Dandy DeKaiser, Jack Roslovic, and Duncan Keith. So we got our six young guns, and I must say, I'm a little bit upset. I'm not quite excited yet, but there's two packs to go. Still yet to see anything that would be hobby exclusive. Joel Farabee, Jordan Stahl, Chandler Stevenson, a pink Jamie Drysdale, Seth Jones, very feminine pink color of the Dazzlers, Drysdale and Zegras there, and Carlson, Miller, and Caprizo. Well... Upper deck, what are you going to surprise me with in this last pack? I'm, I'm yet to see why I bought a hobby box. I know these pink dazzlers are, well, they're every box. They're in hobby. They're in everything. So, come on. What are you holding out for? Last pack, folks. Calling it right now. Last pack is going to be a banger, right? Here, right now. Cole Caulfield. Patient, Mr. Cole Caulfield. Please make a high gloss appearance. Right now. Come on down. You're the next contestant on... What do we got? Ellers. Uh, Gabe Velarde. Dylan DeMello. Wow. Well, there you have it, folks. Sometimes when you buy a hobby box, you get squat in the way of hobby cards. Which is what happened there. I feel I got too many canvases. Whoops. Not enough 
uh, quality young guns. So there, that, <clears throat> that really was a slap in the face box. Josh Dunn, Kyle Burroughs, Keaton Middleton, Art Duritsalainen, Luka Pekalukanen. I guess maybe that's supposed to be our big young gun. I don't know, cause Sabres goalies. But our, you know, nice dazzlers. Can't complain. We got one magnetic, two rookie roll retrospectives. And uh, I got the Caprice off debut date in the French Horvat, which I guess that is hobby exclusive, but that's it. Like, no numbered cards, no, no, like, high gloss, no, um, you know, like anything hobby exclusive. They're, they're supposed to be, that's why you buy the hobby boxes. But nothing. Not a, not a ding-dang thing. So, I'm uh, feeling a little left out here on a Monday morning. You know what? doesn't matter a whole lot because I just had a whole lot of fun ripping cards open on a Monday morning where the majority of the world had to get up and go to school or had to get up and go to work. So, life is good for me. Hope it is for you guys. I'll be back in another uh, blink of an eye because I'm doing these breaks daily until Christmas and beyond. And um, who knows if I posted this before or after the Toronto show. And again, thanks to everybody who has subscribed. I can't believe I've already hit 100 subscribers. I, I really, it does amaze me that that many people joined on. Before I can even kind of figure out what I'm doing here, you guys are enjoying watching. And I appreciate it all. Every one of you is. So I, at some point, I want to say I will do some sort of giveaway when I figure out how to do all that. But like I say, I'm so new at this. I'm like, I'm really not in any position to give anything away yet. I, I, I don't even have a permanent address here. I'm still living with my brother. So that's where I'm at right now. Until I get more established here on the West Coast, I've, I've like I say, I'm, I'm making a big change in my life and having a lot of fun in the process. So, uh, you guys out there, keep on collecting. I'll keep doing the same. Standing ovation, asking you to drop a like, thumbs up, subscribe, and watch me on eBay or break or buy off me on eBay or even check me out on eBay because I've been doing that a lot longer than I've been doing this. All right, folks, keep on collecting. Standing ovation. Oops. Oh, it's getting wavy gravy. I say standing ovation, might break box for this next. Out!